What's up everybody? Welcome back to Pokemon Black. Last episode it was a winter, now it's suddenly spring. But hey, uh, it's been a while. Um, I couldn't upload, you know, because of school. And we're pretty much going at a fast pace here. Um, school's been alright, I can say. Um, I'm recording this today at 3.10pm. And it should be going up later in the day. So... Yeah, I'm sorry for the long delay of episodes. But anyways, um... Today, we are going to leave Castalia City. Um, there's stuff to see around here, honestly. Like, there's a name raider and all that stuff. I don't really think I should really name anybody. And why did I leave the Pokemon Center without healing? So, I will be right back. I am going to go heal up my Pokemon because I'm a little shit. But anyways, let me tell you a quick story. Alright, so I'm in my class, and today, um, you know, we're about to start our lecture. Like, the teacher is about to start talking, and what happens is that the lights go out, and we're we're just here at the class, and it's, like, super hot, because, like, where I live, it's really, really hot, and it's just terrible. We're sweating, everybody in the school sweating. Um... Especially I me, I need to go to the bathroom, alright, so when I go to the bathroom, I have to turn on my phone's flashlight because I can't see, everything's dark. We had a power outage, alright. The lights went out, the power outage, you know, backup generators helped have some type of light in the hallways, but you really couldn't see much anyways. So, what happened was that we... We pretty much got screwed over for like one hour and they sent us home. So that's why I have I actually have time to record right now. <sighs> but still, uh, school isn't really stressing. I just don't have time to do anything other than All-Star Deathsmash. Like, All-Star Deathsmash is just really easy to record. I don't have to use my voice or anything um, for that. So that's why I have that one up already. For me, for this, this is really hard. Not hard, but annoying to record sometimes because there's no time schedule all right and i got interrupted there too um so yeah it's kind of hard just recording at all in this playthrough and there's a lot of bang outside but hey let's just get with the game hey ruben you remember the promise you made on the x transceiver right so let's get right to our pokemon battle but before that mm -hmm. what's going on they say we can have a Pokemon battle in the gate as long as we're not careful to break the electrician <laughs> bullet board. It's a new and improved version of me. I'm gonna do great this time. So let's drop over Pokemon to battle again. Yeah, yeah, Bianca. Alright, let's see how good you do. Get good, friend. Get good. Okay, so today she's gonna start out with her hurtier. Her beer. Get it? It's pretty lame. And it's a girl, too. Funny. Jokes. Okay. Those things has got Intimidate, grrr. Alright, so my attack's gonna be Fallen. Um, I guess I'll go for the Heart Stamp. I know it's not gonna kill at all, but hey, he couldn't, he couldn't move, so that's something. Alright, let's keep using Heart Stamp. Hopefully he gets flinched every time. Yes, this is so good. Okay, I think we may got our first kill. Woohoo, Ric Flair, the Nature Boy, putting Quick Work. Alright, he's got a, she's got a Pig Knight, so should I switch here? Hmm... Mm, I'm thinking about it. Now, nah, switch out. I don't think uh, Pig Knight's a firefighting type. Um, yeah, Pig Knight's second evolution form of Tepig. It's a Pokemon we didn't get. I'm gonna go for the Water Pulse because I'm pretty sure Water Pulse is insta kill on this thing. I'm pretty sure Pig Knight's evolutionary chain is defensive instead of special defense. So, alright, she's got a Pan Sage. Oh, we got our own Pokemon as well. Cheeto coming in is her first battle as a semi seer all right what you gonna do about it flame burst is gonna just annihilate your passage haha <laughs> good day to you ma'am all right so Chido gets that exp she's gonna send out muna now with muna i'm gonna defeat it with nixon here so yeah everybody's getting their own battle it's pretty neat all right so muna with the forewarn only move I can pretty much use as assurance because that's the only dark type move I have, and it's insta kill anyways. So this battle wasn't really hard. It was pretty good. Alright. 
It took quick work of Bianca. Anyways, I'll never be a strong trainer like you or Sharon or Iris, but I know since we live in Uvema Town, I met a lot of people and I've been thinking about what I want to do in life. When you look at it that way, Ruben, Pokemon have given me a lot of new experiences. Having my Pokemon stolen was just really hard. I felt really unsure. Still, I gotta say, I'm glad I went. I learned so much for the, uh, this journey. And uh, I've so learned that being with Pokemon is really important. Okay, well, I hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye. Well, that's just sad. Okay. Anyways, let's go on forth. Because pretty much we got to do... Ooh, I see Charon there. Let's get this item first. Oh, yeah, by the way, this is where I caught... Uh, this is where I caught Sandile. If you don't remember, but let's talk to Charon here. Hey, Ruben. I've been waiting for you to get the insect badge. And now it's time to see which one of us is a stronger trainer. Alright, I guess we're getting another battle. Two battles in a row. Might as well battle our rivals. Alright. Sharon's pretty much the same team as Bianca, I'm guessing. Except he has a Pidov and I think he has Simiseer. I am not too sure on that. I don't think he has a Simiseer. I mean Simiseer. Uh, Panseer. Or, no, not Panseer. Uh, the water one. Jesus Christ. Okay. Heart Stomp should do something. Heart Stamp. Alright, she's going for the Air Cutter. Oh no. Alright, Heart Stomp should do it. Alright, there goes Pidob and Handpour. That's the name of the Pokemon. Okay, see, we don't have an electric type. Um, we will catch one soon though, but we don't have one as of yet. So let's go for the Heart Stamp combo. Alright, see, we're getting, um, we're getting him flinched and he can't move. So if you get hit one more time, he's probably dead. Yes, that was pretty easy. Alright, Leopard, uh, uh, let's see here, I don't have any fighting type moves, but I'm going to use a Hefep to use Razor Shell, because that thing has always been insta-killing, and it's a lot stronger now, so, alright, oh, predicting my pursuit, eh? Alright, and it lowered his defense anyway, so we're pretty good. Alright, so I'm pretty sure he's going to restore health. Or not. But hey, we can get a focus energy. This is going to be a critical hit. And pretty much dead. Watch this be like a critical hit. Oh my goodness. Uh, reading my pursuits. God dang it. Okay. This is a critical. I'm going to laugh. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. GG. So we get to level 28. it. Revenge. Nice. Okay, let's see what we can learn with revenge. It's a fighting type move. I'm gonna get that. Sorry, focus energy. I know you're good in some situations, but I need a fighting type move. Thank you. Okay. All right, she's gonna go for Servine, and we you know we make quick work of Servine. All right, Cheeto, you can do this. All right, Cheeto, you got this. Cheeto's adorable. All right, Cheeto, take care of the Servine. All right, so Cheeto gets a level 25. Nice. And impressive, all right. Why can't I win? It is now clear to me. The reason you are so tough is the trust between you and your Pokemon, but that shouldn't be a problem. I can get more out of Servine and my other Pokemon too. All right, we got an extra Ancier thing going on. All right, let's see. Okay, hello there. Do you have a second? Professor Juniper, do you need something? I called Bianca too, but I guess she didn't hear the call. I wonder if she's caught up in. Well, I suppose I'll just have to call her again later. Okay, I'll be waiting for you to in front of the gate to the Nabasa City. Um, hello? Hmm. Nabasa City's gate is straight down Route 4. Alright, so I guess we're going to the Nimbasa City. But first, I'm probably, we're probably going to have to fight some trainers. So, let's just, you know, do stuff. Get a burn heal, because this guy just got wrecked and burned. Alright, so that guy didn't want to battle, but we're going to battle you. So, let's see what you have to do with us, and I will... Probably not cut this out because I want to talk about a few stuff. Um, Backpacker Jill. <sighs> oh, she's got a Petilla Lily. I don't know what to call this Pokemon, but it's pretty adorable. Um, some Pokemon are really adorable, actually. This one is really nice. I don't remember what it evolves into, but it's a really nice Pokemon. Um, I like I like the design wise of it. Pinito. All right, so we get a Super Potion here if you want it. Um, you don't need to grab it. Pretty sure this is where we have to go. 
This guy's not gonna let us pass. Wow, that is so bullshit. Okay, whatever. Traveling backpacker meets traveling trainer. Uh. All right, Mr. Jerome. He's got a Pidov, so we should be good. Uh, Ric Flair should pretty much make quick work out of this. Uh, with Heart Stamp. Heart Stamp is pretty much gonna be insta-kill, I think. No? Okay, I was wrong. Um, uh, but we're pretty much good. Um, uh, we pretty much have won this match, and I am pretty sure we're getting a level up too. 225 XP. Wow, we're getting a nice amount of XP. That's pretty nice. Okay. Let's see. Let's keep going. Alright. Horde. Okay, so we have this lady here. Hello, Ruben. Come here. Alessa called us and asked me all about electric type Pokemon, and I thought about you guys. Really? Did you really? That's why I wanted you to see. Ta da! Freebies for you! Here, Sharon. You too, Ruben. I got Ultra Balls. Ooh, nice! Okay. We see a Pokemon that you want to have join you. Be sure to use a good type of Pokeball, because this could be the first and last time you see that Pokemon. I know it might be strange to, for me to say this, but I'm the one who asked to, you to complete the Pokedex, but please remember to enjoy your journey. Of course, I'm not saying you can't just neglect the Pokedex, but you know that. Now, if you excuse me, I'm gonna go meet Bianca. Alright, you go do that, ma'am. You do that. You be you. It seems like Professor gave us the Pokedex as a reason to send us on a journey. At least that's what my mom told me. They want us to go out and see the world. My, so my mom, Ayanka's mom, and your mom made a request to Professor Juniper. So what should we do now? I think I show the professor my thanks by going to Route 4, catching some Pokemon I haven't yet caught. Alright, you go do that, but I want to continue with my journey. Um, no quiero estar aquí, cabrón. Alright, so we're in Nambasa City, and holy crap. Gramps, we know you run the daycare. How do we know? Because we're Team Plasma. We're taking away Pokemon from people. Since you work at the daycare, we figure you have a lot of Pokemon. Hand them over. What kind of nonsense is this? Oh! Oh, strong looking trainer, please help me! Alright, Team Plasma, you won't. You're gonna pay for this, man. See, I left Cheeto at the daycare for a reason, and you wanna steal Cheeto? Nuh uh. This isn't going by me. Alright, starting off, Watch Hog. Um, Heart Stamp should pretty. Detect. Always oh, starting off with the detect. Alright, alright. If he goes for it twice, I'm okay. He didn't, but I avoided the attack. What you gonna do about it, huh? And he's gonna detect again! <laughs> he's detecting more than once, and he's probably gonna go for hypnosis. Oh! How does that work two times in a row? You just don't wanna get hit. Don't sleep on the kid, bitch. Come on. Alright. Heart snap. This watchdog is finished. Alright, Trubbish. Oh my god, this is a really easy matchup. Alright, pretty much all you gotta do is just car stop it. Super effective. Easy kill. Trubbish is a terrible Pokemon. Ah, uh, poor Trubbish. Uh, that went down how fast. I think you better ruin. Let's head out to the amusement park. Well, it looks like they're going to the amusement park. Thank you so much. Please take this as a token of my gratitude. It's a brand new bike. Alright. Yay, we got a bicycle, bicycle, I want to ride my bicycle. Alright, so we got a bicycle, that's pretty neat. Hey, Ribbon, yoohoo! Oh, hey, Bianca. Professor told me that Boston City has a lot of things to see and do. The amusement park, big stadium, small court, and the battle subway. I'm going to the Pokemon musical, see you later. Pokemon musical, what is that? Oh, whoa. Oh. But uh, hey, I guess we should, like, find the Pokemon Center so we can heal up our Pokemon. Oh, there it is! Ah, Nido. Okay. Hmm. Alright. Hello, welcome to Pokemon Center. Blah, 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 blah. Gotta heal up our Pokemon. Alright. Got four Pokemon. We're all good. Alright. No, I don't want to talk to you again. Alright, guys. Um... I guess that's it for this episode. Um, kind of just got through the route, beat some trainers. We didn't have much progress. Well, we beat Team Plasma. We beat our rivals. I think I'm gonna end things off here, though. So yes, next time on Pokemon Black, we are going to explore Nimbasa City, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.